This is my crappy RV mattress. Everybody knows that when you live full time in an RV, the mattresses that come with RVs suck. Today I'm going to do something about mine. Hey everybody, it's Robin with Creativity RV. If you watch my channel, you know that this is my third rig. I started out with a Class B, then a Class C, and now a fifth wheel. I love the fifth wheel. It's a grand design, and it comes with a king-size bed, which seemed like it was going to be great. But just like in my past rigs, it came with a really skinny, weak mattress. There is a crater in this mattress. I've had it for about 10 months, and even in the first month, it just started to sag in the middle. And so I put padding underneath it, I tried to support it, I put a four inch topper on top, but still, there's a crater. And with the pillow topper, instead of making it more comfortable, it just made it impossible to get out of. I mean, it's not like I can swing my legs over the side and hop out of bed. I literally have to grab on to the side of the slide and pull myself out of bed. And when Doug's here, it's a comedy. We literally have to push each other out of bed by our feet, help each other in and out with our hands. And enough was enough. I mean, neither one of us were getting a good night's sleep in here. Our backs hurt, our hips hurt. And so we went shopping for a new mattress. So first things first, we're going to get rid of this monstrosity and bring in our new mattress. Now, I actually had to wait till Doug was here visiting because the new mattress, even rolled up in a box, which is how it comes, was 100 pounds. So it's still outside in a box underneath our rig, and we're gonna bring it in and see how long it takes to puff it. Now, one thing I learned in my research is that most RV mattresses are made out of foam, and the foam just gives up after a while. So we found one that had a little bit more structure. It's called a wilderness mattress, and it was down to that in another brand, but we liked this one because they have a 100-day guarantee, and if I don't like it, I don't have to return it. I get to donate it, and all I have to do is show the company a receipt of my donation. And no, for anybody that's wondering, I did not get this for free. I paid for it, and it was $1,000. Now, that's a lot of money. There were other mattresses I could have gotten for four or 500 but they were the same crappy type of mattress that's already on here, and I don't want to buy a new crappy mattress every year. I'd rather spend the money and get a mattress that's going to last a while, Fingers crossed, this is the one. No. It's a beast. So put it out the front door? <laughs> yeah, for now, put it out the front door? Yeah. Even the pad is impossible. Okay, fair enough. We're not the smallest people in the world, but this is ridiculous. I mean, look, this is the mattress that our RV came with, and it's just, like, disintegrated. <sighs> so, now we have to get this old mattress out the door which is not going to be fun, but I'm not sad to see it go. Oh, just getting it to here completely took it out of me. Why is it so big this direction and so skinny that direction? Uh, 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 you hate it. Good boy. <laughs> so you can see how weak it is. Not you, Doug. The mattress. This is the box. This is our massive 100 pound box with a broken handle, so it's hard to carry. It's but, a uh, team lift, apparently. Team lift. We are team Robin and Doug. So we're gonna open up the box and take the mattress out instead of taking the whole box inside, right? Yes. All right, let's do it. Awesome. This. All right, that's how it comes. It's cool. hard to believe it's gonna puff it. Pull that under. New mattress. Oh, is that a pillow top? It's so comfy. It's already better. So that was no joke to get up here, but look, you can see that it has actual coils and stuff inside. Ooh, Ooh coils. Nice, nice. Caution. Place mattress on the sleeping area before removing plastic. Careful not to damage fabric. The mattress will begin to expand to its original size. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yay, it looks like it's the right size. Yeah. What is that noise? Listen. I think it's already filling with air. Oh. I can see why you have to get it in place first. Yeah, this is a oh lot of air. Wow. It is literally pouring out. Literally 
It is expanding. It's like popcorn. Oh my god, watch. They said it opened in 20 minutes and I didn't believe it, but it might. As you can see, it's really puffing up. That's nuts. I already want to take a nap. Wow, it's nice. It's a lot better, so, right? So, so, so soft. soft and firm. Oh, so nice. Yes. We decided we finally had to get up because it was hard for the springs to sprung while we were crushing them. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna edit that part out. I didn't know where Doug was. Wow. It is comfortable. It's nice. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Rolling. Really? <laughs> Quilts, it's so hot. Just, you're smothering me. Yeah. <laughs> well, people, see that empty white space right there? I'm about to get in it. Hope you're all doing well out there and enjoying your day. Until I see you on the road, have happy travels and be free.